coming through. Out of our way! God damn it! Allow me. Nothing to it. And there he is! I knew you were the right man for the job. There's no denying you're the real deal. Not like these idiots with their excuses. Rather have one of you than 20 of them. They're just doing their jobs. Can't expect them to be at your beck and call. What exactly is it you're trying to say, Merc? We need people who can follow orders, too. I see now. Heard you were ex Shinra. Guess I shouldn't be surprised you'd go to bat for your old buddies. Me? I'm just looking out for my people. All there is to it. Hell with you. We can take care of this town ourselves. No more Mercs or Shinra. We'll build up the watch and kick you all out. Okay then. That's another solid gig in the books. You know, the whole town is really impressed with what you've done. Keep it up and you'll have enough work to keep you fed for a lifetime. All thanks to you. And don't you forget it. So where do we get paid? The shop or something? Yeah, but why don't we head back to the apartments first? Take a quick breather. Which lesson was that again? Lesson one. Got it? Anyway, let's go.
job ridding us of that test. Wait, when talks about you, you're the best thing since Marlo. Maybe we never should have moved after all. This town. So this is all avalanches? Glad we no longer have a rat problem. Who's gonna ride them? A husky guy and a lean guy. But it doesn't matter. All you need to know is they both give us a lot of business. So he's the rat slayer. Don't take your eyes off me. This easy. The storms are rational. Don't take your eyes off me. Hopefully, we'll get an update on the situation soon. Shimmer must have threatened his life or something. What would make him want to leave? Easy knowing you're around. Huh? Someone's back awful early. Not that I mind. Would you two be dears and swap your filters out for me? I left them in your rooms. Sure thing. Not so fast, you. Do me a favor. She needs a friend. A real friend. Uh, we're already friends. So when she talks, are you really listening? Thinking about her and her feelings? Or are you just going through the motions? Go on. Take care of this real quick, okay? Sure. Come over when you're done. Done in a bit. <sighs> Finally. <sighs> so, after you left the village, hmm? I let you off the hook before, back at the hall, but not this time. Uh. Uh. Hmm? Well, when we were kids, everybody wanted to be a soldier, right? Yeah, I remember they were on the news every day during the war. 
Thing is, by the time I finally made it in, they didn't need heroes anymore. It was nothing like what we dreamt of. It was just working for Shinra. Just... I'm sorry. I know it's a touchy subject. Not exactly small talk. Especially with someone you haven't seen in a while. I get it. Still, it's kind of funny. Us going our separate ways, thinking that must be it. That we'd never meet again. And then here of all places we do. You know what? We should totally celebrate. Let's dress up and hit the town. Really? I mean, why not? It'll be fun. Do you even have fancy clothes? Not like fancy fancy, but I'll figure something out. What do you think would suit me, huh? Something exotic? Uh, really? Then again, if we're making an effort... Be sure to pick an outfit that goes with mine, okay? Will do. <laughs> this is gonna be so much fun. You'll see. Yeah. Maybe. <laughs> and on that happy note, I think it's time we head back to the bar. Come on. Uh, you don't need a break? Honestly, I'm feeling pretty good. Marl isn't always right, you know. We took care of the filters, so we're gonna head back to the bar now. Take care, you two. Oh, you're looking pretty chipper. Uh, I don't feel that different. Must be my imagination, then. <laughs> anyway, keep your wits about you, Merc. A token of my appreciation. Be good to her.
seeing more and more cats around here lately. And of course, they all come Just to me, but I can't complain. Cats. They're so adorable. I've been seeing more and more cats around here lately. Good to see you. Take all the time you like. And here we are. You must be tired. Same as you, I guess. Could use a little something to take the edge off, right? How about a refreshing cocktail made by yours truly that you can sit back and savor? Tifa. Yeah, I'm feeling it a bit too. Hey, do you think you'll stick around a little longer? <sighs> Maybe. Work for a minute, build up some savings. I see. So, what'll it be? Wanna head back out for a little while? Yeah, why not? Take your time and stock up on what you need to keep our streets safe.
Well, you want to head inside? We're back. Did you have fun? <laughs> Lots of fun. Hey, need y'all downstairs. Uh, right now? Then the plan is... Marlene, want to go wait for Jesse out front? Okay. <sighs> Looks like we're officially on for tomorrow night then. Gotta go over the details with the others. Before you do, about my pay... You'll get your money. So sit down and shut up until we're finished. Double time, Tifa. Sorry, but it shouldn't take much longer. In the meantime, <laughs> grab a seat. What'll it be? I don't know. Something hard and bitter. <laughs> Well, most people would say something sweet right about now. I'm sure they would. Ah, but you're a more discerning customer, aren't you? In which case... Our house special, the Cosmo Canyon. Beautiful. I gotta go. Uh, enjoy. Huh? Hey, you see the news? The reactor bombing was the work of the eco-extremist group Avalanche. Public enemy number one. Gets your heart racing, doesn't it? They don't know our faces, so we're in the clear for now. But we'll want to capitalize on this momentum. Speaking of which, you coming on the next one? For the right price. Oh, you can bet I'll be pushing hard for a raise. <sighs> Tifa will be joining us too, but I don't know. Even a blind man can see her heart's not in it. She was never on board with the bombings. So if it comes down to do or die, if I've got to put my life in someone else's hands, then... I'd rather that someone was a professional, like you. Could still kill some time. up with that girl anyway.
Maybe just chill a bit.
I heard you're having second thoughts. I know we have to think big if we're going to make a difference. But not like this. I just... I feel trapped. If it feels wrong, don't do it. kick you out? We agreed to disagree. So, you want another drink? Tifa! Time to celebrate. Break out all the good stuff. Oh, sure. <clears throat> we won't be needing you for this next job. Feel free to look for work elsewhere. Fine by me. That's how I like it. No contract? No obligation. Figured you'd say that. Here, the rest of your payment, along with a little extra for your exemplary service. And thus concludes our business. Gonna have to ask you to leave now. This here's a private affair. Sorry. I tried. We talked it over, but... In the end... We didn't want to put so much on you. This is our fight. Jesse, what's the holdup? Be right there! No hard feelings, huh? It's fine. Let's talk more after I'm done here, okay? Really, it's fine. Come on, Jesse, I'm dying here! I'll catch you later. Sorry to keep you thirsty boys waiting. Avalanche! <laughs> that hit the spot. Damn, Biggs. Slow down. <laughs> keep it. We'll talk later. I promise. Sorry, you were saying? More reason to live it up now. Yep. Best way to clear your head so you can focus when it counts. It's... Oh, no. You bet. Okay. What were we talking about? Not since we went on that all-night bender. When the job's done? Okay. What were we talking about? So what? Okay. What it were we talking about? It was an amicable separation. Uh, just thinking about it's making me mad again. I'd offer to share, but... Uh... Where were we? I can't believe it's already been if we were all pushing real hard for you. So, where'd we leave off? Well, I do. It was you guys going above and beyond. Thank you. No need for that, boss. We all knew what we were signing up for. Yeah, but when shit hits the fan, it's good to know you in my corner. The end of the day, you're all I got. <laughs> Happy to look out for you, like I know you'll look out for me. So long as someone looks out for my stomach. Tifa's got you covered there. As a friend, or as a cook. Because if you really gotta ask. <laughs> hey, <laughs> right? little guy. You need anything? <laughs> oh, yeah. That <laughs> tingle! <laughs> I guess it is kind of obvious. <laughs> you know, it'd be really cool if we could do this again tomorrow night. Oh, we will. Avalanche! Avalanche! <laughs> you heard him, it's on for Why sure. Why not every night? <laughs> <laughs> you guys. <laughs> so what? We just hang around here till he What's shows up. With up? Big guy with a gun for an arm. Where it is? He lives in this town. Just shut up and wait. We'll. Find him soon enough. Man, seems like the boss. <sighs> hey, brother, you from around the way? I guess. No big man with a big gun strapped to his right arm. 
Heard he set up shop somewhere in the neighborhood. That depends. Ah. <laughs> Clever. Smell an opportunity to make some scratch, do you? Five hundred. Two hundred. Hmm. Three. Whatever, man. Let's find somewhere quiet to talk. Walk with me. Got something to say? What? You looking at me? They gonna hmm? you too? Hey. Move it! Are I you said so sorry? move! Look at all these assholes staring at us. This shithole's got nothing on Wall Market. Am I right? Word of advice, Blondie. Don't piss off my friend here. You'll be real sorry. Unless you got some kind of death wish, then be my guest. <laughs> After you, brother. And don't worry. I ain't the backstabbing type. Most days. Spill it! You know where the bastard's hiding, don't you? I told you before. That depends. Oh. Oh, yeah? You wasted my time! Shinra's time, you mean? <laughs> Shinra knows better than to stick its nose in my boss's business. Like I give a shit. Spill it. You know where the bastard's hiding, don't you? I told you before. That depends. Oh yeah? You wasted my time! Shinra's time, you mean? <laughs> Shinra knows better than to stick its nose in my boss's business. Like I give a shit. Here we go. <laughs> 
Problem. Lesson one for life on the ground floor. Get some rest. Hey, this looks like a. Got the latest and greatest Shinra brand new. gonna let me in so we can talk in private guess I'll get right to the point then huh what have you got there an apology for not getting you on the mission uh. or not what do you think it is a proposition Nailed it in one. Gonna have to ask you to keep all this a secret from the others, though. It's a personal matter. Something I need to sort out tonight. Tonight? Tonight. You and me, together. I want you to come with me to the Sector 7 plate. I'll give you the details on the way. That's fine by me, but don't you have a pretty big day ahead of you? I do, but if I don't deal with this now... It's only gonna get harder. Anyway, I can count on you, can't I? Hmm. A down payment. We'll be back before morning, in case you were planning on traveling light. Make sure you've got everything you need before we leave. I'll wait here.
You all set? Awesome. Meet me at the station after dark. Don't be late. <laughs> it's just another job. Tough break. They changed the times. Last train's already left. Which is why we borrowed these bikes. Need a lift to the plate? How did you guess? Easy. You've been acting weird. Like talking about one thing when you're obviously thinking about something else. Yeah, and don't get me started on all that pep. All right, I'll give you that. But how did you know I wanted to head topside? Was I talking in my sleep? What else did I say? No, we just figured you wanted to see your parents, that's all. Nailed it, huh? Yep, right on the head. So, seeing as we don't have any family of our own, how about you let us be a part of yours for a bit? You know, spread the wealth. Hmm. Are your parents still around? Huh? Uh, no. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay then, guess you're all invited. Here's to awkward family reunions. Yeah! I take it you boys have your brand spanking new IDs? Yes, ma'am. Then let's lay down some rubber. Crank that product! Okay, you got it! You hear me? Yeah. Just so you know, I'm not going plate side for the reason they think I am. Look, you saw the way the reactor went up. It was huge, right? Because of all the Mako. Isn't that what you said? Yeah. That was wishful thinking. Deep down, I know it was my fault. I used a more powerful blasting agent than the directions called for. It had nothing to do with the Mako. Let's say you're right. So what? I'm planning on using a weaker blasting agent this time. But, since I can't get in touch with my supplier, our only option is to loot a warehouse owned by Shinra. Shinra? Good luck with that. With your help, we won't need luck.
physical force? What, so you just pull over if they ask nicely? Uh, got a point. Shut up. 